Welcome back to another Hookah Sessions ATL. Last episode I reviewed the Haze Majestic Brew. Well this week we will be trying another one of the new Haze flavors. It is the Jazzy Fay Pineapple Crush. It's the fifth of the Jazzy Fay line and it is the definitely the most straightforward name. If you're in it for the names you should stick to the Panty Dropper or to the Oh Boy Explosion. This is just straight up Pineapple Crush. Smells like pineapple. Tastes like pineapple. The website has it as a sweet pineapple with a cool refreshing taste. Not to be confused with the regular original Haze pineapple which is just a dollar cheaper, mind you, and tastes like a slice of heaven according to their website. Uh, to me, they taste pretty much the same. This one has a little bit of a cooler, more refreshing aftertaste. Uh, however, they both are straight up pineapple. Uh, I don't understand why you would do this to us, Hayes. Charges a couple of dollars more for basically the same flavor. Uh, it is a very natural tasting pineapple. It doesn't taste artificial uh, like the Fantasia Aurora. That is just, it's a good flavor too, but it's just tastes like a candy pineapple where this is like not an actual thing. When you're packing haze into the bowl, you want to use a light, fluffy pack, and I would recommend using a vortex or a funnel bowl. If you don't have one of those, I would suggest a deeper bowl rather than a wider, shallow bowl. Just because you can hit haze with a lot of heat, and that way you're going to get a lot more smoke, it's going to last a little bit longer. Don't overdo it or it'll start tasting like a campfire, you don't want that. Uh, but haze is known to hold quite a bit of heat, and that's why it's a little bit extra juicy. The molasses helps with holding the heat in without burning the actual tobacco. Whereas drier tobaccos, less heat is better, or else it'll just start burning. Overall, I would give this like a 7 out of 10. It's a good pineapple, don't get me wrong, but it's the same pineapple as the original Haze. And this is going to be a dollar or two more, and you can only buy it in 100 and up sizes. So if you're looking just to try it, honestly, just stick with the regular pineapple. Maybe throw a little bit of mint in, you'll get the little crisp crisp aftertone. Other than that guys, I would, this is one of the ones I'm going to turn down for you. That wraps us up on another Hookah Sessions ATL. As always, my name is Michael. We did the Pineapple Crush. Stick to the regular Hayes Pineapple. It's basically the same. It's a little bit cheaper. Stay tuned. I'll have some new content coming your way shortly guys. See ya.